This is a cassette tape, but it's not just any ordinary cassette tape. Instead of storing music, this tape stores DNA. Researchers at Southern University of Science and Technology in China created what might be the future of data storage, a cassette tape using synthetic DNA molecules instead of magnetic signals. It's designed in such a way that the DNA bases A, T, C, and G translate to digital information, just like ones and zeros on a computer. This means it can store any type of digital file, so text, image, audio, or video. This is huge because we're facing a data storage crisis. Current computer storage relies on semiconductors, so the chips in your phone, your computer, etc. But we've hit the physical limits of Moore's law. We can't make these components much smaller. Meanwhile, data creation is exploding exponentially through photos, videos, streaming services, and security cameras. TLDR, we're generating data faster than we can build storage for it, which is why these DNA cassettes are making headlines. They can store about 455 exabytes per gram. But what the heck does that mean? Well, one exabyte is 1 billion gigabytes. So one gram of DNA could theoretically store 455 billion GBs of data. That's like fitting the entire internet into something the size of a sugar packet. For context, a traditional cassette tape can store about 12 songs on each side, whereas 100 meters of this new DNA cassette tape can theoretically hold more than 3 billion pieces of music. So here's how it works. They made a long strip with barcodes printed on it, like barcodes you see at the store. And each barcode creates a separate folder where they can store different files. The system then uses printed barcodes that correlate to different DNA files. The machine scans the barcodes to find the right one and then translates the DNA into a digital file. It's like the Dewey Decimal System, but for DNA instead of books. But the more mind-blowing part is how long these tapes can last. The tape is coded in what they call a crystal armor, which prevent the DNA from breaking down, meaning these tapes could store DNA data for centuries. In fact, researchers estimate data could survive over 345 years at room temperature compared to hard drives lasting three to five years. I can hear you all asking the question, can I play these cassettes on my Walkman? Gen Z and below are like, what the heck is a Walkman? The answer is yes and no. Yes, in the sense you can do anything and have free will, but if you do put this DNA cassette into a tape player, it won't produce any real sound. It would be like trying to play a photo on your iPod. And if you don't know what an iPod is, if you like science for sharing like this, follow us everywhere at Today Learn Science at TIL Science.